This is how you can apply a threshold effect on your videos. Here in After Effects inspired from Fred Pele. Let's go and create a new composition. I'm going to go with 1080p, rename it as Threshold, click OK. I'm going to drag and drop the video into the composition and I'm going to make it start from here. I'm going to go with 11 seconds, bring the work area in. And from here, let's go to Layer, click on New and select Adjustment Layer. You can rename the Adjustment Layer, Threshold. And now we're going to go to the Effects and Presets, type in Add Grain. Drag and drop the Add Grain on the Threshold Layer. And here we're going to go to the view mode and change it to final output. As you can see, it is adding some noise and we're going to go and increase the intensity of it. I'm going to go all the way to 4000 and I'm going to go and decrease the size of the grain, make it nice and tiny, softness, increase it a little bit to 1000 and aspect ratio as well, increase it something like this. Let's go back to the effects and presets, type in threshold and drag and drop the CC threshold on the threshold layer. And as you can see, now we got this threshold effect going on with a lot of noise, which we're going to need to customize it. So let's go to the threshold and decrease it. And this is going to open it up and make sure to check it if it looks good or not. But I think this is pretty good already. And let's go to the effects and presets, type in fast box blur, drag and drop the fast box blur under the threshold and increase the blur radius a little bit. So it's going to be like 0.2. And this is going to make the noise soften a little bit more. So here it is without the fast box blur and then with the fast box blur. I might also decrease it to 0.1. Let's go back to the effects and presets, type in tritone, drag and drop the triton under the fast box blur. And here you can change up the colors of the composition. So I'm going to go with a highlight. I'm going to change the white to some orange, light orange, click OK. And now I'm going to go to the mid tones, change it up. Probably going to go with some blue. I'm going to go with purple, click OK. Hit play and it looks something like this. Right now we get a lot of movement, but you also can simplify the frames by going to the effects and presets and type in posterize time. Drag and drop the posterize time under the tritone. And the more you decrease it, the more frames it's gonna remove. For example, with 10, let's see what happens. I'm gonna hit play and you can see it's simplified quite a bit by removing quite a bit of frames, but this way it looks even more dope. And that's how I make this thrash threshold, my friend, here in After Effects. Thanks for watching.